CNN's Chris Cuomo recently called out Senator Ted Cruz in a big way by saying the Texas senator was too afraid to talk to him. Too bad for Cuomo, things just blew up in his face as Cruz unleashed the liberal network's worst nightmare. CNN is fake news. At this point, there's no arguing against it as you pretty much have to fact-check every report they release due to the lack of credibility. However, members of the network have actually had the audacity to fight back, saying that the claims are untrue, which is just more fake news. A.D. Adspire of Content, perhaps most notably known for that is host Chris Cuomo who seems to be really bothered when people call CNN fake news. For instance, take a look at how he flew off the handle when the Office of Management and Budget Director Mick Mulvaney said it to his face in the clip below, Hillary's entire hit list just went public. You'll never guess who's won Health Sciences Institute X Adspire of Content find out more greater than 79,269 in fact, it bugs the lying moron so much that helps even compared it to being called the n-word twice Adspire of Content the hidden link between Alzheimer's and Barry's memory repair X World War II discovery kept secret for over 70 years this will make you furious natural health response X here's what new dental implants should cost you in Rochester don't overpay save on dental implant ads x of course, Chris Cuomo has more than earned this reputation for being fake news. However, seeing how he hates being called the term so much, you'd think he'd be a little more careful when it comes to what he puts out there. Intentionally skewing the facts or leaving certain details out in order to appease the narrative is just as bad as lying and that's exactly what the American people are sick of from the liberal mainstream media sources like CNN. For some reason, Cuomo has perfected the craft but has a shocking sense of self-loathing over the reality. Unfortunately, he has shown no signs of stopping and just proved that on Twitter. According to the man's recent post, he inferred that Senator Ted Cruz was a coward, saying that he was too afraid to come on CNN for an interview, as the Daily Caller reports. If Cruz thinks gun control improvement is not the answer, what is Cuomo tweeted? Ask the question, Senator, what are we going to do to stop school shootings? Don't just say what won't work, work to find an answer. According to IJ Review, Cuomo's lies blew up in his face as the Texas Senator unleashed the cretin's worst nightmare. In just a matter of minutes, Cruz would unveil the fact that Cuomo was fake news by saying that he had already taken part in an interview and it was actually CNN that chose not to air the footage. That's funny, I spoke to CNN for 15 minutes yesterday about proactive solutions to prevent gun violence like passing the Grassley Cruz bill, which Dems filibusted, that would add $300 million for school safety yet CNN has aired none of it, Cruz shot back. Why not air the entire interview even better yet, he released a picture as proof that he did just as he said, Ted Cruz has never been one to shy away from a fight, and afraid should be one of the last words used to describe the man. Then again, this is what you get when you talk out of you simply make things up as you go along. Chris Cuomo is a certified hack, and it's time that he gets some perspective. Cruz nailed the point home by reminding Cuomo that he is anything but afraid of the morons over at CNN. Gosh, I seem to recall doing not one, not two, but three town hall debates with Hit Bernier's on as on at CNN each 90 minutes long. You can accuse me of many things, but being afraid of CNN is not one of them, he tweeted. The fact of the matter here is that actions have consequences. Sure, mistakes happen, but they seem to happen at a rate much higher than anywhere else when it comes to CNN. In fact, it comes at a rate so high, that it's almost like it is happening on purpose. Retirees in New York don't miss this one change that increases your monthly income. Agora Financial X Adspire of Content find out more greater than 55,437. If CNN and Chris Cuomo don't like to be called fake news, then they're going to have to try a lot harder to make sure the truth comes out a lot more. Trust is earned, not given, and it's going to take quite a bit of time before they re-establish the credibility that they voluntarily lost with these partisan antics.